The investigation is happening right now at a bar and grill on Colonial Drive near Cimarron Boulevard, not far from the Orlando Executive Airport. News 6's Eric Von Anken is there live now. And Eric, what are investigators telling you? Ginger, not a whole lot. I can tell you, though, they were out here serving a search warrant. They just left a little while ago. They were in here really in the back area, the back parking lot. They went through that back door and they walked out with bags, couldn't tell what was in them. We asked them, though, if their search warrant had something to do with the cameras and surveillance video. They didn't tell us. In fact, they're not telling us much. Detectives spent the entire day here, late this afternoon, going inside with evidence bags and firefighting tools, not saying exactly what they were coming out with. This was after spending much of the night here at El Rinconcito. They were called out early in the morning for shots fired and found a man hit in the head sitting in a car. His passenger was not hurt. Orange County deputies aren't saying exactly what happened here, only that armed security guards were involved and deputies are talking to them. Less than a year ago, the parking lot looked very similar. Detectives, crime scene tape, and flashing lights. They found bullet holes in a building and a car windshield, and two people shot after a fight. The sign calls El Rinconcito a bar and grill, but neighbors tell us it's more like a late-night party place. I'm pretty sure somebody was intoxicated or had something in their system, because uh, <laughs> it's usually that kind of party. This barber next door says he's usually leaving for the day when people start coming to the bar for the night. I know the cops are definitely aware of it. They've been here a number of times in the past. Well, we asked deputies about that. We asked deputies also about the man who was taken to the hospital, the one who was shot. So far, no answers on either one. But coming up at 5.30, you will hear from neighbors about what they're concerned about, how they say things need to change out here for their own safety. Again, that's coming up at 5.30, but for now, Eric Von Eichen getting results. News 6. Ginger. Eric, thank you.